Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm a teenager. And you're by yourself. You're on your own. All right, now what? Infiltrate the fortress. So that's where the Grenier leadership have been hiding. On a moving fortress inside an asteroid belt. The queens have to be here. I'm going to infiltrate the base. <coughs> yeah, she can't. Spoos. Lotus, are you receiving me? So I'm gonna recommend... <laughs> Yeah. I'm gonna recommend you seeing your number two and your number three because yeah. you're almost dead. It's just, I'm. <clears throat> mm. I got some liquid that I was trying to drink stuck in my oh throat. No. Oh and no. I just. Why are you I wish the wrong I could way? pause. Why are you running the wrong way? I want to run somewhere so I can cough. <laughs> I'm not okay. even joking. Okay, okay. <laughs> <coughs> that was bad. Mm. I apologize. It's really I trust me. It's not that I'm so bad at playing. It's I really had to <laughs> cough. So sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But yeah. So the Kuva Fortress is no joke. It's hardwired with traps and shit everywhere. So keep your defensive abilities up and uh, stay mobile. Okay. I tried to kill that. You Where? can't. You can't. Waste of ammo. Oh. Yeah. You cannot shoot the security cameras here. These are very tough security cameras. You can shoot the, the turrets that spawn out of the ground. That will temporarily deal with them. What do I do here? Well, look at look for consoles. But oh, I shoot. see some consoles right there. I do not. What's shooting at me? There's a guy. You're standing right next to a console. Like, this? you're standing... No. You were standing right... But it says right control console. Yeah, but you were standing right next to the console you were actually going to click on. Okay. Up here. This one? Yeah. Oh, okay. There you go. And in we go. Lots of new stuff to scan here. I know, I'm barely seeing anything <laughs> because everything is kind of like the funny yeah. orange color that Helios makes it. It's a new class of Grenier. The ones in the Kuva Fortress. Okay, where now? Just oh, follow there. the map marker. The, 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 uh, it's a bit... Oh no, the... Uh, the uh, like uh, interior and like the architecture, whatever of the Kuva Fortress, is super confusing. Yeah. It takes a long time to learn uh, how to how to move around inside the Kuva Fortress. What does Kuva mean? We'll get to that. We will get to that. For now, it is a resource that you were able to get us like a night wave award. No, you can't shoot the. You have to get used to that. Yeah, not I guess. here. This? Yeah. And now? And put it in there. You're right next to it. Oh, right there. No, no. What? Down here. You have to oh. separate the map markers from the uh, focus, whatever. Oh, you have to find three of them and put them in different things. Yeah, I saw another map marker yeah, yeah, here, yeah. so I was like... Well, you can only carry one of them at a time anyway. All right. All right. Yeah. Ah, so many little beats. Yeah, I know. All right, put in a new one. And find the third. Whee! Nice. Eh. Eh. Excellent. Where? I don't know. Shoot that turret. Oh, it's inside. How do I get in there? Uh, try going down here. Here? No, here. Here? Yeah. Look behind you. Look behind you. No. No, 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 not here. No, no, no. Go back. Hmm. Follow this path. Yes. That works. Yeah, it's going to take a while, and it's it's, it's going to be hard for me to give you, like, up, down, left, right directions. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, the left side. Yeah. Left side. Left one. There you go. Oh. I could see which ones you had slotted stuff into and which well, ones you had. Well, I couldn't see. I couldn't tell. Let's put it like this. Okay. Did you click on it? I did. Do it again. Go back further. Yeah. There we go. Weird. Anywho. Oh, that's creepy. L Lotus. If you can hear me, something's tampering with the transference tree. I'm going to locate the source. Oh, um, boy. Mama. 
I know I said I could do this by myself, but uh But but suddenly the Grunier <clears throat> the Grunier Queens can also talk inside my head. That's weird. I'm starting to have too many people in my head. Why can the Grunier Queens talk in your head? They're Grunier. Grunier are very low tech compared to to most of the other things we've encountered. And Corpus, they're tech tech, but not voodoo tech. They're just tech tech. Tenno stuff is a different kind of technology. Yeah, I'm voodoo tech. Seeing as how Warframes are made of like mobile. What is this? Why is there a countdown? Oh, oh that's <laughs> that's just focus. Ah. That was your your 45 seconds of extra focus. You have to get. <laughs> I got really stressed. I was like, what's she even talking about? Because I'm so used to it that I didn't even think about what it was. Yeah. I don't like this. Neat, right? That's what I saw in the cutscene. Yes. They're gonna plop out of there like the creepiest birthday cake girls ever. <laughs> Woof. That's me. That is you. Inside of your orbiter. But shouldn't Ordis still be able to talk to me? I know this place. It looks actually a bit like where I found myself. It looks a little bit like the reservoir, yes. Oh. Hello. Tashin? shouldn't have come here. You have ruined us both. I think the Grenier are so cool. I think the Corpus are cool as well. Oh, I guess it's not a birthday cake plop out. It's a descent. Oh. Dax, you're with them. I have come as you commanded, my queens. Oh boy! If what? This is your offering. My sister needs the orphan child, not its infested puppet. The child? For what purpose? <laughs> to eat it, of course. Ooh. Hush, worm. Do not question your lords, Teshin Dax. Bring me the orphan. Bring me my Yuvan. What? Enough! <gasps> How rude! <laughs> oh, it's not their fault, worm. Mummy and Daddy weren't around long enough. To teach them any manners. Ouch. <laughs> we will have to. Okay, I have been betrayed by Teshin. That's kind of your thing, being betrayed? Yeah, because I'm what a stupid teenager to, who just rushes into Transfer things. Surge, You're losing your warframe connection. So have some idea that you're invincible, don't you? Nestled away in that mad Cephalon's crib. But you belong to me now. For you see, child, we can see of these ugly metal cysts. Did you? Operator, cut the limb. What? I... I can't. We get... Your precious gifts. You and did? Now, just as easily, we take them all away. Cut the link. Transference opener. What? I don't understand what's happening. Well, you will. Soon enough. So, Tashin. Te Tashin. Fucked me. Yeah. Metaphorically. Because uh -huh. we just talked about how he doesn't do that literally. Look, it's you inside the orbiter. Uh, and it's snowing. It is snowing. In my orbiter? Isn't that nice? 
So now I grab another Warframe. Well, so long, Mesa. <gasps> oh, look. What's that? Robot fish. Orokin robot fish. Are you telling me my Mesa is gone? Orders. Ship Cephalon? More like Ship Ferrobot. <laughs> the operator needed you most. Orders. You enough. Operator? My stars! Don't do that to me. I am sorry. I do not know what happened. Please, command me to self-destruct. Let me start it for you. Commencing self-destruct in five. God, four, for this. You're so uh, dramatic. What? What's with the music? Isn't it great? I can lead you through some reading exercises. <laughs> oh Just my turn god. It off. Get the transfer <laughs> okay. I lost my warframe. I'm trying. You may need to do your uh Tenno thing again. Re-energize it. You know, with your void stuff. Hmm, your void stuff. What? You're so helpful or this. Hey, but my Helios is still here. So yeah, there's... hi Helios. How did you get here? Yeah, that's a bit weird. <laughs> okay, oh well. so how do I cast my oh like this? Yeah. Uh, ow. I can't. It's gone. What? What? Gone? Are you sure? How will you command the warframes if your conditions satisfied? Engaging purge preset. What? What? Or this? Purge. Purge what? Ordis, what the hell? You are no longer recognized as the operator. You no longer possess transference. <laughs> you no longer command the warframes. You no longer are the operator. Ordis! Ordis, you, oh. you little shit. Non operator, I'm sorry to inconvenience you, but I'm going to decompress the ship. Ordis! <laughs> you probably should run. Ordis cannot keep missing me. Oh. Get out of here before I purge you. I can't? Oh no, I can. Yeah, here. Yeah, up there. You will be purged. Or this. Exterminate. Exterminate the non He's going like Mad Hardy on me. Hey, this doesn't seem to work. Uh, Maybe try a different path. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Better, better get a move on. Or this. Eh? Uh, for real, though. Yes, that is for real. Where even am I? At the mountain pass? How nice of him. He didn't. He didn't decompress the ship. He just dropped you off. Uh, okay. Bye! Ordis, you fucking asshole! Hey, that language. Ordis! You fucking gigantic asshole! <laughs> well. I can't believe you've done this to me! Well. Uh, I'm sure, I'm sure. Suddenly I'm playing Skyrim again, I you guess. You are, yes. This absolutely feels like... Uh, what's I'm it called? I'm walking up to the Greybeards, like the, I don't know, 8,000 steps or something. Yes, that mountain pass. Yeah, Throat of the World. Throat of the World. God Hrothgar, damn it. Hrothgar, or is that something different? Hi, Hrothgar. Hi, Hrothgar is at the top of the Throat of the World. Ah, yeah, it does. It, well, actually, it's the very Throat of the World of is the... Is the it is mm -hmm. the, the uh, summit summit yes the summit the word well we should probably see if there's a way inside of this mountain because being here on the outside seems like it's not gonna end up well for you okay i just thought i was supposed to go further up uh-huh it seemed like the thing to do to follow this flaggy path uh-huh ah! why are you i it's pushing me off well fight against it then instead of just I'm trying. Okay. Oh, come on. Can you hold shift to walk faster? I am holding shift yeah, the entire not. time. So, yeah, maybe. So, you have to walk against the wind when it's blowing. Yeah, just stuff him in the closet. He, he One just, second. Yeah, while I do this, Nick has to go and stuff a cat into my t shirts, which is where he wanted to be all along. 
I have now stuffed a cat inside of the t-shirts. Well, you just <laughs> cleared the path for him. Yeah, it's kind of weird. Like, did you know that if you have a screaming cat, you just kind of take that cat and stuff it in the cupboard and the <laughs> cat will be happy? So try walking on the right side of the path. Mm. It's probably going to be helpful. Yeah. yeah, and now... Not, not too close to the edge, because I think you can probably fall off on the other side, too. So we just gotta... Mm. Yeah, work it, girl. Mm. Work it, work it. Not I too do, close to the edge on this I side. I do not like this. I think you can probably fall off both sides. Yes, yes. All right. Congratulations, you made it to the first flag. Great. Now then. So... How long is this going to go on for? Because it's not... Not that long. Entertaining. <laughs> not I want to know what happens next, for fuck's sake. You're gonna, you're gonna. Don't worry about it. Now we're doing the Hobbit, walking alongside the cliff. Yes, yes. Look down. That's some deep snow. Oh, yeah. Wish I was Legolas. Mm-hmm. No, you cannot walk on... That was one of the coolest scenes. I, li I love that scene in The Lord of the Rings. He's just walking on the snow while everyone else is like trudging through it. Hey. That's one of the coolest scenes in the movie for you. They did a lot of stuff that with Legolas that I really like. I loved when he just grabbed onto a horse and flung himself on it as well. Sure, sure. As I don't know, Legolas just him. isn't one of my favorite characters. Well, there were some things that weren't <laughs> as good, but but some things were. There, there's cool stuff there too. I didn't like him I didn't trying to like get drunk the, in the extended edition. I did not edition. like him it's surfing fun. on a shield. No, no, the no. Fucking surfboard, and he surfed on uh, like an elephant trunk as well, and that was even dumber. Mm. Like none of the special effects. I like like the subtler just. Why is there Whoops. fire in here? I don't know. Who that? Who that? A mummy. That's a mummy. A <gasps> what happened to you? They gave up. You. You fucking you asshole. Me. You infested piece of... Oopsie. Oh dear. Did I forget that I was just a little kid? I know, right? Who yes, currently doesn't do even it. have void powers. He doesn't know that, apparently. Oh, he does. As I thought. The hard way, then. So, the great Teshin is just a dog. Fetching the queen's stick wherever she throws it. I warned you. Now you're trapped inside this place with the queens burrowing in. Now I am forced to undo what Margulis did to open the gates and make you suffer. What? Yeah. So he said. Now you're inside here and the queens are burrowing in. That hints the fact that you are currently inside of your brain. Oh. None of this is real. Then how can I die inside of my brain? That's well, stupid. Well, you didn't. You fell off the mountain, but you didn't die. Yeah, but I had to do it again. So he's like, oh well, the queens are gonna burrow in. Which means... That a lie of omission. She did not cure the Zeremen children. She erased them. My only hope is that truth still lingers inside you, buried within your mind. The power and the misery of the void. Yeah, because Margulis, she, uh, she saved you by turning you into a weapon. And, it, you know, trapped your brain inside of the second dream or whatnot. But, but he's like, you're currently not strong enough to withstand the queens, so... We're gonna have to actually wake you up. The Ayatin sculptures are perpetually in motion. Monuments of Oregon continuity. Immortality. But this one is halted and aging, needing you, as the queens do. Will you give in to them? Or will you face the coil? So Oregon she said, continuity. She said she was facing continuity. Does that mean that they're like at the end of their lifespan and are gonna die or what? Or it will be uh, everything will be revealed. We are at the precipice of this, so if, as you can see, they're glowing. That usually means interact with them somehow. Yeah, but yeah, that doesn't work. So no, try maiming for the right spot. 
What is the right spot? The glowy parts. That's not the glowy part. This? No, the white things in the middle are the glowy parts. They're moving. They're glowing. I'm sorry. The what? stalactites in are yeah. the glowy parts. So okay. That's what you meant. Whoopsie. Yes. So you have to go around. To no, like? you can maybe aim at them from here. Aha, now you can aim for the middle one, perhaps. Yes. Oof. Took me a while when I did this quest. It takes everyone a while hmm. to actually get some sort of idea about what they're, what they're supposed to do. But how did Teshin get inside my head? Oh, I broke a bone. Or I broke someone else's bone inside of my leg. I remember. Mother takes your head. Lying. Am I gonna eat her? <laughs> Oof. Yeah. She's yeah, actually, you probably better leave that in. Kids, if this ever happens to you, leave it, leave in. it in. Pulling it out is pretty much death. Why does it have to be ravenous? 